Hey everybody, Rock Paper Mario here, and welcome back to Floroma Town again, because what I did in between videos was, this morning, when I got up this morning, I was a good little boy, and I slathered the honey on the bark. Didn't I? Did I not slather the honey on the bark? Maybe I just skipped that one? I hope not. Otherwise, this is going to be, like, the the biggest, like, fail blog of all time. Well, this one is shaking. I must just have forgot that one tree. Let's see what this has in store for us. You! It's always you. Always you. Every time I come down in the kitchen, you're there, in the refrigerator, eating all the food, all the pig's feet, all the collard greens. I like pig's feet. That's one boss. No, I'm not going putting honey on the bark. Um, the, uh, yeah, I went to the trouble of getting, um, where are my repels? There. I went to the trouble of, uh, of, of pushing the, um, pushing the honey on the bark, or so I thought. I thought that I was after pushing it on that other one, but apparently I just did not. Um, but yeah, there is like another tree in here. There's this like little shortcut, if you remember, which like allows us to skip a, a long slog through Eterna Forest. For for you, it would be like the third time. For me, it's like the 20th time is what it feels like. But there's an, another tree here. So maybe this will have something good. Holy shit. That is worth the apom. Okay, we are not, like, fucking around with this thing. We are literally just going to stun it. Also, I had, like, the animations off again. I'm going to catch you in the Premier Ball cause you, because you're worth it, L'Oreal. No! Isn't this, like, a tiny percent chance thing? As far as I know, I like I don't want to screw around with like trying to damage it because I'll kill it. It's only he's only level seven. We got a hair across. This thing isn't this like something like a one percent chance or something? It's like the next rarest one after Munchlax. Because Munchlax is like 1%, but it's only in like a certain number of the trees. But isn't like Heracross like a flat 1% chance to find one? Jesus. I should be so lucky, 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 lucky. What do we call this guy? I have no idea. He's like the beetle. He's like the stag beetle. He's like, Mom, why'd you have to call it stag? Stag Hunter. Well, no, he's not like a stag. He's like a Hercules. He's like Honkules. <laughs> Don't you mean Honkules? <laughs> he's like a Hercules beetle, isn't he? <laughs> Don't you mean Honkules? I can't, like. How do we even spell Honkules? Do you know what, like, my, my partner was. I can't believe Honkules even fits in. Hunkulees. We're gonna be getting him out of that box. I'm gonna wash that man right out of my hair. I cannot believe that we actually got that. We can talk to this lady. We got a big tree? Whatever. Oh, that's for the stupid fashion thing. Silver pow- Oh, that's actually really useful for us. I wish I had got that before losing against, uh, against Jupiter. I, I, like, I'm speechless, and there's still one more tree to check. Um, there's, like, berries over here. As you saw, I got, like, um, I got Fury leveled up. Fury didn't learn shit. I checked the, well, she did, but I checked, I actually went to the bother of checking what, like, what Beautifly's learn set is in Generation 4, and I was like, well, I guess I missed all of the da attacks you can actually do damage with. And they're growing bigger. Make him fatter. Make him fatter. 
But yeah, I miss like all of the, the attacks like Gust or Absorb and things like that. So now I have to wait until Beautifly learns Mega Drain at like 24 level, in like level 24. So what I did was to get like her leveled up, I, I taught her return because I was like, at least that's something that, that's useful and that's, it's a good attack, you know. Anyway, we already got lucky once. What is this going to be? Yes! It's a Burmy, one of the many we need. I actually want to get all of these ones. Well, like the grass one I could take or leave, but I definitely want to get like the female ones for the steel and the ground ones. Again, I'm like not fucking around with this. Also, I forgot to turn on the emo- the emotions. You give me emotions. Higher than I've ever before. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You got me feeling emotions. Higher than the heavens above. We're just gonna try and catch her. Every time it does that flashing thing, I think that it's like a crit catch, you know, like in Generation 8. Fairy did learn Stun Spore, which is going to be really, really useful for catching Pokémon like this. Um, like, actually, even though it, it technically, like, um, like, sleep is makes things the easiest to catch, I actually prefer Paralysis because they ca it doesn't need to be reset all the time, you, you know, and usually there's an easier way to get it on them. Whereas, like, the sleep-inducing attacks are usually less accurate, so... Anyway, we caught our first female Burmy. We need to give her a nickname. Because she's going to become Wormadam. Splash Woman. Um, Splash Woman. I don't know. What is she? What is this Burmy? She's like a leafy worm cocoon thing. I don't know. I'm like still in shock from the Heracross from Honkules. Don't you mean Honkules? In like my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game that I've never played after like five times, I'm like a team, really dysfunctional team of Cubone and Psyduck, and the Psyduck is named Honkules. <laughs> if that helps brighten your day. Let me see, it's like a rainy day, it's a. Today, where I'm drinking a double espresso next to the microphone. Um, I don't know. We'll call her Mariah because that's what I was singing, even though I got the lyrics wrong at that one part. Because it's not like you got me feeling emotions higher than I've ever before. I was like, what the hell? It's like you got me feeling emotions deeper than I've ever dreamed of. Oh, 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 you've got me feeling emotions higher than the heavens above. And then there's like that crazy part in the middle where it goes like, um, um, where she goes like, inside. Ooh, 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 ooh. Like it's just like crazy. That song has like such a good groove. It's insane in the membrane. So we've got two new family members. Bug booted up the PC. We're going to get Niles. I think it's time for you to take a break here. We need to we need to move over. No, I didn't want to see your summary. I just wanted to move you. I just wanted to get you out of my way so I could get the Honkules in here. Um, it is like a. I've got into like this habit of like just recording one video a day now. Um, because the, um, I've got into this habit now of just recording a video, like, one video for the next day. I never thought that I would be that Let's Player who was just like, yeah, I'll record to th tomorrow's video, you know? I never thought that would be able to be me, but it's actually quite pleasant. Let's see what we're dealing here with. Hunk you these. What na- mild nature. What does- strongly defiant. I like that. What does mild do? I wish I could look this up, but I don't have my phone on me. Mild nature? The Isled ones? I hope it's not something like low attack, high speed or some shit. No, that's timid, isn't it, I think? What about Mariah here? Hasty nature, strong-willed. Um, so what are its, her stats like? 
Hasty would be high speed, low defense, I think, isn't it? Or something like that? I have no idea. Anyway. We'll see. Two new family members. I'm glad to have you both aboard. Huncules, we're going to put you out front because you're, like, starting on the back foot. But um, what I was saying about, like, what I was starting to say, also now I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. I'm just going to go south just in case there's anything back here. Like, back where Orberg... What? Who are you? You're, like, blinding me with science. Yeah, exactly. Who the fuck are you? Dawn's father. How many Pokemon have you met? You've met 49 Pokemon? Bravo! Oh, that's actually... That couldn't have come soon enough. That's, like, exact... That's, like... It's, it's like... Um, it's, like, just what I needed. Um... Where is it? You give me just what I needed. Where is it? I suppose it's here. Experience share. I can give that straight to Hunkulies. Um, and then I don't have to have him all the way up. Stop going to the summary, please. I'll just switch into... Well, no, Fury still needs the experience here. Well, no, we'll go to... I don't want to spread my... I'll go to Mariah. I need to, like, figure out, because I'd like to get, like, the ground one or the steel one going. What are you up to? Oh, this is the cycling road? Okay, well, I've got a bicycle for you. A bicycle built for two? Oh, a trainer. I don't know why I didn't think that there'd be trainers on this bicycle road. But yeah, what I was saying about Hercules is that, like, I was asking... Do you know that joke, the way at the start they're, like... Um, at the start, they're like, Hercules? Don't you mean Honkules? Like that one of the muses says, or whatever. Um, we need to switch here. To, uh, to Honkules? To, to cool, I guess. Um, but like, I was asking my partner, like, what does, what do they do in French? That's great, thank you. What do they do in, like, the French version? Because you can't really make that joke. Well, first of all, Hercules' name isn't Hercules in the French one. It's He's Hercule. Like, so, which already is funny. And he was like, oh, they just say, like, don't you mean Hercule? So just, like, with a, so the same word. So they just say the same word, just with, like, more emphasis on the first word. Which I think is kind of funny, because it's like, the equivalent would be is if, like, in the joke, in English, if you said, like, um, if you said, like, Hercules, don't you mean Hercules? <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. And I was trying to say that that, like, doesn't make sense as a joke, it's just saying the same word, but, like, he was like, no, it does make sense, because the first time you just say Hercules, and the second, Hercule, and the second time you're like, Hercule, and I'm like, what? That doesn't make any sense. Um, oh, did our, like, cloak change? How are we going to fight this thing, by the way? I am terrified. I think Clarice is, like, the only thing that we can use to fight this, because we have, like, the power gem. We have the power gem. We'll always save the day. Or whatever. Clarice. I need to go back to Quantico. This one, this dope with the stupid haircut, the one with the pompadour Elvis, you're gonna let her push you around? I need to turn back on those battle inf in, in informations. Um, animations. Hunkily. Once Hunkulies comes out of the box, it's like when finally someone let him out of his cage. There's gonna be carnage. Like, the, the, the world will never be the same. It's like everything was fine until Hunkulies attacked. What does she look like now? I think that's the ground one, because the steel one is pink, isn't it? I think. What nature is she again? A hasty? I think that's, like, the ground one. What was I going doing, by the way? I was going doing something. I think the steel one, like, you need to fight something in a building, as far as I know. So, actually, it probably would have been great if we had been able to get, um... 
It probably would have been good if we had been able to catch Mariah before the Team Galactic hideout, but oh well. I was incompetent. I put my hands up. I didn't slather the honey all over the bark. Also, I'm incompetent. I forgot to turn back on the animations in between the previous battle and this one. I'm telling you, Power Gem is like saving our ass right now. Like, if we'd been going up against these po like, if we didn't have this rock attack, I didn't even anticipate having this. Huncules is gaining those levels. Huncules is in the gym, pumping iron with Philatetes or Philoctetes. I think I, like, look when I was reading something about Hercules one time. Like,. I always thought that, like, Danny DeVito's character was just named Philotetes, because that's the way they say it, but apparently, according to the way you write it, his name is Philoctetes or something. Like, is that true? I remember something like that. Here, why am I, like, acting like the, the Burmy, like, Mariah is going to evolve, like, anytime soon? Like, doesn't... Doesn't, like, Burmy literally evolve at something like level 20-something or something like that? Like, every bug Pokémon? Is there a bug Pokémon that, like, evolves at a level that's quite high? The only one I can think of is, like, um... No, we're just gonna stick with Clarice. Just gonna take everything out. Kicking ass and taking names. The, um... Yeah, but apparently, like, Phil Octetes... They don't say it like that. Well, half of the time they just call him Phil. They're like, that's Phil's boy. Um, but yeah, the only bug Pokemon I can think of that evolves at like a relatively high level is like, um, is like Volcarona. I know that only too well from the Pokemon Shield Let's Play. I'm trying to get that thing. Seem to have fallen off my bike. Yeah, a giant laser beam shot at you by an enormous wasp will do that. Do all these people just have bird Pokemon? I guess so. I don't know if they have a kind of a huge cry, don't they? So yeah, I still need to find like a male Burmy to get Mothim and then two more female Burmy to be able to get um to be able to get the two other worm madams. Splash Woman. I still can't remember, like I remember I was talking about in like one of these one of the Pokemon Shield videos about like Splash Woman. And like there's some like video, I can't remember which video it is. But there is, like, some video that I can remember where, like, someone... We're dead, <laughs> by the way. This thing could just take us out, actually, like, one after the other if we're not careful. Like, might Fury be faster? I feel almost like going for it with Fury and trying to get Stun Spore off is, like, the smartest thing. Yes, thank you. Did I still not turn on, on the animations? Okay, stop talking about your bullshit all the time. We need we have a job, we need to remember to turn on the animations after this. Ah, the gamble paid off. Dobby, the gambler. That's four levels for Huncules within one video. Anyway, no more talking about whatever inane anecdotes you're talking about. We need to turn on back on the battle animations. I don't th think that even, like, going this way does anything for us. I'm, like, afraid to, like, uh, <laughs> run headfirst into her. Oh no! We should have gone back and healed uh, Clarice. This thing's- oh no, it's a Pikachu. That's alright. Are we- is, like, Burmy a ground type as well when- when we have, like, the Sand Cloak? Or is Burmy just a bug type? 
I think like Mariah is, is like simply a simply the best, by the way, but simply a bug type until she evolves. Even though the standard is like with the grass cloak. What was I talking about before getting onto this uh getting onto this like train of thought? I can't remember. How dare you? Oh, that's even worse. What was I talking about? I was talking about her as Hercules, I was talking about Phil Octetes. I need to look that up as well about like Phil Octetes. What was the other thing I wanted to look up? There was something else I wanted to look up. Oh, oh yeah, like what the hasty nature is and what the mild nature is. Fraser? You used to be the bug Pokemon I could rely on for like the first, whatever, eight videos of this Let's Play. It's like you should be you should be feeling the you should be feeling the pressure right now. We've got all these other Pokemon that that are your rivals that you have to compete against. I'm like going back by the way to heal up. And I suppose we'll finish the video as well, to be honest, because we've been going for like 20 minutes, so... Thank you very much for watching this part of Let's Play Pokemon Platinum The Bug Catcher Run. In the next part, we will continue on that cycle path for better or for worse. I'll see you next time. Bye now.